Today we're going to take a quick look at the GS21 HMI from Mitsubishi. It has a 10 inch TFT color, backlit LCD, and touchscreen with a WVGA pixel resolution of 800 by 480. And it supports up to 65,000 colors, and the touchscreen is analog resistive. Now, as far as ports, the GS21 has plenty of them. It has one 10100 Base TX RJ45 Ethernet port, which can be used with controllers and also to upload and download applications to it. And unlike some of its competitors, the unit also includes two serial ports. It has one RS422 female D sub 9 pin. This can be used to connect to controllers or up to 10 devices like servos or VFDs. The unit also has one RS-232 male D-sub 9 pin for controllers and barcodes. In addition, it has one USB mini B port, which can be used to upload and download applications, as well as an SD card slot, which is for project data read writes and logging data. Now, as far as specifications, the product has a voltage range of 20.4 to 26.4 VDC, and its power consumption is rated at 7.6 watts at 24 volts DC. As far as environmental ratings, the front of the HMI is rated for IP65F, and the unit's operating temperature range is from zero to 50 degrees C. Now the unit is programmed using GTWorks 3 version 1.250L. Now, having said all this, I found when I was researching this product online, they just came out with a newer model, and these newer models have expanded memory. They've upped it from nine megabyte to 15 megabytes. They also updated the RS-422 port, adding RS-485 capabilities and Modbus support. They also added support for the outline font, which includes any aliasing as well as an operator log function. So all operations can be logged to the SD card. And finally, they added VNC server capabilities. Now, while I don't have one of those newer models, I am looking forward to programming this one and getting it to communicate with my FX5 controller. But with that said, that'll wrap up this first look at the GS21 HMI from Mitsubishi. Now, if you enjoyed this episode, please give us a like and a sub. And until next time, my friends, peace.